saw a picture the other day of Jesus in the Garden of Gethsemane. You see the picture, he's got that beautiful robe and dressed in white, Brother Phil, and they got the sunlight coming down, the light out of heaven coming down on him. And <laughs> I was telling a lady the other day, I said, if you think that's what it was like that night, you are sadly mistaken. Amen. It was nothing like that, Brother Gary. It was nothing like that. That was a time of suffering. The Bible said that the sweat was in great drops of blood. Yes. Amen. There was no uh, there was no glamour about that. Amen. We're going home one day after a while. Glad for that today. One eighty. Have you ever heard this song before, preacher? Never. Well, we'll sing it for you today. How's that? There's a happy land of my own.
I'm sorry? Thank you, Lord. Oh, amen. Come on, Lord. <laughs> Let's everybody stand if you will. Let's take up our offering. We'll come in and go to God in prayer. I mean, not for the offering. Father, I'm most kind of heavenly gracious, Father God, Lord. What a joy and blessing it is, Father God, yeah. Lord, to experience this salvation, Lord, that you give us, Father God. Lord, help us and guide us through this service, Lord. Father God, Lord, help us and guide us in this offering, Father God. Lord, that we can always teach and preach Jesus Christ, Father God. Bless those who got, those who don't, Father God, Lord. Forgive with a willing heart. For we ask you, Father God, Lord, in your holy blessed name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. As soon as it comes through, let's come in and fellowship. Many years I've
up. It's probably been 20 years or more since I saw that song, but it's a good song. I was telling Paul I stepped on a man's grave the other day. I looked down and I still call him my Uncle Henry. He's actually Paul's Uncle Henry, but he was so good to us. And I've never known a more perfect man, I believe, in, the, in this world than Henry Wiley. But one day, Brother Gary got sick. And he began to think about eternity. Yeah. And I remember his testimony. He said, you know what? I was good to my family. I was good to my wife. I was an honest man. I've never stolen anything. I've never told a lie. And I've treated people with respect. And he said, ain't enough. And I remember the day that he told his son, he said, I want you to take me to church. And I need you to help me get down to the altar because I need to pray and ask the Lord to save me before it's everlasting too late. And that was his testimony. But that's what he was. But he knew, Brother Gary, that all that goodness is not good enough. He needs to be saved. Amen. And I loved his testimony over the years. Anybody else with a song? Anybody? Huh? Oh, don't sit down. Oh.
Thank you, Lord.
right time. Amen. 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 Well, now my daughter lived out in Knoxville for a while, and her husband got a job, and they had moved to Bristol. Or she went up there, whatever. No, he did, and but he was trying to find a place. Couldn't seem to find a place for nothing. She was down in Knoxville, and she was expecting her second child, and she called me, and she was crying. She said, Mom, Chris is looking, but we can't find anything, but the job is there. What are we going to do? She said, I don't know what to do. I told her, I said, I'm going to tell you something. Now, my, my daughter was a, a, a sinner girl. I told her, I said, you go about your business. I said, you don't have to get down on your knees. I said, if you can, that's fine. But you begin to talk to the Lord. Amen. And I said, I don't Amen. care when you're sitting at your computer typing at work. Lord, make a way. I said, Lord, make a way. I said, when you walk through the house, you begin to clean. Amen. Lord, make a way. I said, you know what? You talk strictly to the Lord. And I said, when you say, Lord, make a way. I said, believe he's going to hear you. I said, and he'll make a way, my And she called me back two days later. She said, Mommy, I've done exactly what you said. She said, I can pray. Amen. Yes, amen. Well, he, he already knows all about us. He now knows what we're going to say. Yes, amen. He already knows. But like I said, he's waiting on us to trust him to get us there. <laughs> when we get ourselves out the way and start doing God's business, amen. then we'll find it goes a lot better yes, than amen. the mess we make of it. Because Lord knows I made a, quite a few messes. Like yeah. I said, I've had to take them Lord's whipping, but when you do, you learn. <laughs> and you know not to do it again. But when we get to the part we understand God can't lie, God can't fail, if that was the only things God can't do, then what we belly aching about? Amen. Really, what we belly aching about? Because <clears throat> we's the one that makes it hard. It ain't God. God said he made this whole thing easy for a child. That child right there would understand. But we make it hard. Amen. And my sister was in the same boat as her. And I kept telling her, I said, Kim, just pray. And my sister isn't a praying person either. I said, Kim, you just got to pray and trust God. I said, everything happens for a reason. And I said, God will make good that reason. He said, he won't put no more on us so we can bear. See, that goes back to my pity party I was trying to have. God won't let me have it. He said, now, nah. what, what you doing? I, I didn't tell you to feel sorry for yourself. I said, stand up and get busy. And getting busy is telling God of his love and his mercy and his kindness. Because he, he took all that for us. I said, it'll come right on time. 
It took her three months, honey, but you know, she thought she had this HUD house, it was all perfect, you know, HUD house is automatically up to code. Well, it got took from her. They mm -hmm. outbidded her $20,000. So she was going to her thing and this house come up and these people thought they had this house and they say, don't make a, a purchase when you go to buy one. Well, they did and it proved their credit and they put this house on the market. As soon as they put it on the market, my sister put the bid in and it went right through. So, like she said, we just gotta pray. We gotta have that faith. When, when we when we don't when we don't work that faith, how do we expect God to work for us? And I just like I said, I'm just I'm in such awe of our God, and I'm just thankful this morning. Thank you, Lord. I, I, I'll never be able to stand here and thank him enough for what he's done for me. Where he brought me from. One day I came to see that sweet face. Say thank you, my Lord. Somebody else with a song? Dave, I have one. I read in the Bible how things in the past felt compelled to God's promise where the faith put the test. I know they had a hold of a powerful hand in the midst of the storm when they should have gone down. They found strength to stand. So let the flood waters blow, let the storm winds blow. Let everything hell has tear in my soul. It may hinder me, bring me down to my knees. That's as far as I go. Not a balance been lost on an old rugged cross. I'm gonna reach heaven no matter the cost. This mountain I climb, I just might find sweet heaven in view. Now these dark stormy days we're living in They're bound to shake us time and again But the same grace he gave them He's given to me And that same mighty hand that caused them to stand Gives me victory So let the flood waters roll Let the storm winds blow let everything hell has tear my soul and may hinder me, bring me down in my knees, but that's as far as I go. Not a battle's been lost and a whole rugged cross. I've got to reach heaven no matter the cost. This mountain I climb, I just might find sweet heaven in view. Yes, mountain I climb, I just might find sweet heaven in view. Amen. Jesus did for us. Amen. Amen. But how 
how can you be anything but happy over there? That's right. When you leave behind all your burdens, all your cares, all your troubles, Amen. and all that we carry from every day. And even knowing all this and then having the joy, I can't, if I were to ask people to lift their hands, so many of them are under such a load today. If it wasn't for God, we couldn't take it. That's right. Amen. Amen. But over there, the load's gone. That's right. The former things are passed away. And everybody you meet has a smile on their face. Yes, Lord. And in the presence of God. Amen. Everybody, not one. <laughs> Bless the Lord. Think about that. Yeah. I don't know. I'll think about it the rest of the day. I'm not real profound. <laughs> not one second. But, you know, I'm just glad I get to go there. Yeah. I'm one of them. That she saw and found. Yeah. On that little lamb that got out there and got trouble, and he went through the wilderness and picked me up and brought me back. Yeah. Yeah, I wasn't looking for him, Gary. I wasn't trying to be a Christian. Yeah. I didn't even care. And he told me to be. We'll sing this song. I thank God for the saints. Both them that went on and them that are here. Yeah. Amen. <laughs> I'm thankful for these testimonies that we hear. Because we need that today. It's one thing to look back and say what God did. It's another thing to say, look what God's doing. Amen. Amen. Yeah. To give us hope, as they spoke of, for what God will do. You know, one thing about God, He didn't change. He's the same yesterday, today, and forever. Right. He said we have not because we ask not. We'll ask him faith, believe him according to his will. We've got no reason to believe he wouldn't do it. Mm -hmm. this time, mm -hmm. I don't know. I thank God for that. You, you know what heaven to say. Brother you know, Scott, a real beautiful song. And it, it's personal when you start putting faces to it. You know. He greets me every Sunday with a smile. Race will be over another mile. Still he keeps pressing along. I don't know what I'll do when he's gone. I just want to thank you, Lord, hey, boy. for all the saints that I've known, for sending them my way while I'm on my way home. I know. This road. I just 
her cross for such a long, long time. Led me to Calvary, where I found mine. I just want to thank you, Lord, for all the saints that I've For sending them my way while I'm on my way home. This road that we're walking somehow don't seem so long. I just One day 
<laughs> Once again, we're thankful to be here this morning. Amen. Uh, can't think of any other place I'd rather be than here this morning. Amen. Anybody here ever heard of the Greystone Chapel? Stewart, if you know country music, yep. he recorded. Yep. They want to go see the man with the gospel song. And they want to go see the man the story behind it. Greystone Chapel was in Folsom Prison Blue, or Folsom Prison in California. The man there doing years of his time. Marty Stewart went and in, uh, interviewed him. He's talking. He said, I'm free. And he said, how can you be free? You got big, big walls and barbed wire and guards up there. He's going to shoot you if you touch that wall. <laughs> but he said, I'm free in my heart. He, got he said, there's people on the outside of that wall hiding as in prison. Good man. Well, a lot of things in their hearts this morning. I, everyone, and there's got a lot of people I, I tied up in prison this morning. I, 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 well, you can get there. I, 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 in prison. He said, I'm a free man. I, 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 these balls ain't what got me in prison. I, I'm not in prison. I can't get across the wall. But he said, God, I save my soul. He said, I'm free. He said, no matter where I'm at. He said, I'm free. Let me call. Let me sing a song. Hey, back there in the prison. Hey, man. Listen this morning. Hey, nobody. And nothing. Hey, man. That can keep you in prison. Hey, man. If you'll call upon the Lord this morning, you can be free. Amen. From anything that has you down this morning. I thank God this morning. Hey, man. Hey, listen. I hear them testimonies. Hey, man. Hey, listen. And they're good. Hey, man. Hey, listen. A lot of time. And they listen. We overlook. Hey, man. The little things that God has done for us in our life. Hey, man. Hey, man. I have food on my table this morning. Hey, man. Thank the Lord for that. Woo! Anyway, honey, listen. You can have joy in your heart if you got God in your heart today. No matter what you're going through. Anyway, honey, listen. There's joy in it. Anyway, there's joy in it. Uh, someday, uh, Amen. Uh, listen, uh, I'll get uh, Amen. Uh, uh, but I'm going to know the righteousness. Uh, 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 Jesus. Amen. Uh, 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 but first, uh, uh, everybody in the Bible say, my biggest say, He saved me that day. Amen. Amen. Listen. Amen. I'm telling you, today, amen. Honey, it's going to get hard out there. It's going to be Christians. Amen. Hold tight to God and believe and have the faith. Amen. 
God can grant that you throw anything yeah. at this old world yeah. has to throw at you this morning. Amen. Yep. Amen. Amen. Yep. Amen. You know, it. Right. part of my sister's funeral. Listen, they put him down in the ground. Anyway, her husband wouldn't even go. He couldn't go. He said, I can't, I can't watch them go down in the, in the grave. But, I don't know how many years, but a lot of years they were married. Anyway, and he couldn't go to that part of the funeral. But listen, anyway, it's like Stevie said. That part of God left the Monday at 5 o'clock when he called her home. Anyway, the rest of this is just an old sinful body. Anyway, preacher, you saying you're a sinner? Yes, I am. I, I do see. I come short sometimes. Amen. Well, a lot of times. Amen. Well, about all the time, sometimes. Amen. Honey, listen. If it wasn't for the mercy of God, amen, where would we be? Amen. If we hadn't had come from the God, amen, when you come, we might not be here. We must be held wide open without Jesus Christ this morning. Amen. But they give us a rose. I thought it was to take home. But it was to throw in the casket. You know, that's the most they got them down. You know, I thought, boy, that's just pretty. But you know what? That's you know what? This morning, we need to pass a few roses yeah. around here yeah. while we're living. Hey, my God. Hey, my God. Hey, my God. Let me listen today. Hey, my God. I don't send me no flowers. Hey, my God. If you can't, I say something good about it. Hey, my The Bible says it. Hey, my Don't say nothing at all. They asked me who I want to preach my funeral. I said, I don't know. Well, half of them will not know. No, I don't know. We're giving you the grace. There's somebody. There's joy and peace in God. Amen. Amen. He spent a lot of years in a boy Amen. Behind bars. Amen. Amen. But he found Jesus. Yeah. Amen. A lot of them says they find him. Amen. But you never see him come back. There's something wrong with that. I got to say, but I don't go to church. There's something wrong with that. Bless the Lord. I was drunk. You can't call me a drunk. Amen. Bless the Lord. If I tell you I'm a Christian and I never go to church, Amen. What are you gonna find? Ain't something wrong? Amen. Honey, listen. Hey, the turkey said it one night, and we won't keep you long. Amen. I got a clock up right now. Amen. Amen. I'm gonna make my Jerry over. Amen. I don't take a marker and put it over when the preacher is supposed to shut up. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're thankful today. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Like we said this morning, Paul said all things behind him. Paul the educated man, the way I look at it. Yeah. Amen. Had some power to do it in his hand. Yeah. Amen. He'd go in churches, drag people out. Yeah. I'd have been killed. Amen. Yeah. Hey, listen. Amen. Hey, 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 well, one night on the road to Damascus. Yeah. Hey, Amen. Hey, hey, he wasn't on that road to meet Jesus. He was on that road to go. Hey, hey, and I can wait to church. Hey, 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 listen. Hey, Jesus said enough of that, Paul. Amen. Amen. But he said, Lord. Amen. He knew who he was. He said you would call him. He knew who he was. Amen. Amen. Most people, if they say, I don't believe in God, you must know something about it. Exactly right. Yeah. And you say you can't believe it, something you don't know. Yeah. Bless me. Leave a drink of Bless him, Lord. Bless him, Jesus. Bless him, I'm going to read you two verses in Philippians 3, 21 to 21. For our conversation is in heaven. 
from whence also we look for our Savior, the Lord Jesus Christ. We shall change our body, 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 body that it may be fashioned like unto the glory of God, the glorious God. Amen. According to the working whereby he is able, even to subdue all things unto him. Amen. Listen. You can take that word conversation. Amen. And you can put in there what it means, I believe. Amen. Amen. Our home in heaven. Amen. Listen. Amen. Our dual citizenship, brother. Amen. I didn't listen to that. Amen. We don't have a lot of time. Amen. We work hard. Amen. And we get. Amen. We get that old house paid off. Amen. And we think we've done something. Amen. I didn't listen. I'm old man. Amen. Amen. That will pay all your sins off. Everything that you've done in your life. Amen. They used to be. I read something. I know. They had an old history thing. Amen. Honey, listen. They said back then. Amen. If you couldn't pay your bills. Amen. You took a gold skin. Amen. And you nailed it up. Amen. On the wall. And you wrote in all your bills that you couldn't pay. Amen. And if somebody could come along and pay them, they'd take it down yeah. and go pay their bill. Honey, I know a man that went to Calvary and paid my bill on sin for me and on the hill of Calvary. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Too many times <coughs> we fail to thank Him. Amen. We thank Him on the big thing. Amen. Amen. Who you think was watching over you last night? Amen. The devil wanted in. Amen. The devil wants to get into your life today. Amen. He never takes a break. He's always on time. Amen. If you get rid of the day, you can count on it. He'll be back in the morning. Amen. Honey, God never left them. Amen. They went through some things. 
Yeah. And sister, hey, man, but he never left them. Amen. Oh. Thank you, Lord. Never left them. And no matter what we go through, and I'm just going to put it this way, even death, hey, man, you know what we can go with one another to that grave? Hey, man. Hey, man. We can watch them put down in the dirt. Hey, man. Hey, man. We can do it all we can do. Hey, man. That's as far as we can go. Yeah. Hey, man. With somebody. Hey, but they lost to this thing. I don't believe. There's nothing in between. Amen, brother. I believe you. When God set foot on one land on one, one foot on land, one on water, I believe it's over. Yeah, a lot of people do different. I don't care. I'm responsible for what I preach. Amen. Amen. None of us, some people may leave the church. Amen. But what are you going to look for? Amen. Amen. Oh, I know all these preachers here preach the Word of God. If you leave, where are you going to go? Bless the Lord. Amen. 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 Jesus asked him, Are you going to leave me too? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where are we going to go? Or do we? For you have the word. That's right. Of eternal life. Where are you going to go? <laughs> well, I, know. I know where we go, preacher. <laughs> We're going to get us a big old church. <laughs> we'll sit where nobody knows us. We don't have to do nothing. Amen. We don't have to say nothing. Amen. And nobody will know us. Nothing's reported of you. Amen. Honey, listen. He said he saved us to do a good work. Amen. Amen. He didn't want us to do it save us to be seat warmers. Amen. Amen. He said just to do something. Amen. 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 He saved us. Amen. You know what? Amen. Listen to People are looking for happiness yeah, in this whole world. Yeah. And there ain't none out there. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. I can't, now I got it on my mind, I can't bring it up. But amen. Amen. You will never find happiness out there. Amen. Of the world. Amen. We got to walk in this world, but we don't have to be partakers of it. Amen. Honey, listen. Amen. Honey, uh, when they get everything they want, uh, amen. Uh, then what do you turn to? Amen. Uh, people with one million or millions of dollars a lot, uh, amen, end up broke or dead. Uh, amen. Uh, oh, hey, you get everything you want in the world is good. He said, what does it do? Amen. Uh, to give all and everything and lose your soul. Amen. Yeah. It's true. Yep. Everything I got's going to burn. Yep. One of these days. Amen. Amen. Insurance companies will be glad of that because if we're gone, nobody has to pay. This is that one. But you know, amen. When I take my last breath, I'm paid up. Amen. Amen. I was taken before Christ. Amen. Amen. For what I've done good and what I've done by God. Amen. But I got a promise. Amen. That I'm hanging on to today. He said, I'll never leave you. He said, I'll never forsake you. Amen. And I'm holding it to it. Amen. I believe in God today that He'll walk all the way, amen, through the grave into heaven with us. Amen. The grave cannot hold his people down. Amen. <laughs> Listen, old man named Pi Gibson had a wood like him here down with kids. And when my dad run around, they jump around with each other. They say they told me this. Amen. And they always said to each other, you die, I'm going to be the first one to throw a dirt in your face. Amen. But when it come right down to it, they said, we couldn't do it. Amen. Honey, listen. They ain't a grave made. They ain't a concrete ball. They ain't nothing made in this world that's going to hold God's people down. When he said, makes a call, they're all coming up, and we're going home to be with God. Amen. Testimony. <laughs> I still got an arrow left on God. Yeah, you got it. Wait. You might get in the open now. I'm going to aggravate him all the I'm kidding, man. Don't bother me at all. <laughs> you already turned it back an hour. <laughs> 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 
go plenty of time. <laughs> but you know, there's coming that day. Amen. Matthew 25 and 31. <laughs> Amen. They're coming that day. Amen. The sheep and the goat. And we're going to stand before him. Amen. He's going to defy the Bible. Amen. I'm glad. Amen. That I'm on the side of the sheep this morning. Amen. 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 Many are going to say, Lord, I've done this. Yeah. Amen. Bless the Lord. I've done that in your name. Amen. But he's going to say, listen, I'm sorry, but I don't know who you are. Amen. Are you, you know, there's a lot of crooked preachers in this land. You know, send me a thousand dollars and I'll give you my blessing next week. No, the only blessing would be me if I took a thousand dollars. That's what some of them is preaching out there. Yeah. Some of them is one of these churches climbing the hill of the cripple. They might get up out of the wheelchair and walk, run around. It's phony. Most of it is phony. They might. There was one guy that worked for people like that and told all the secrets. They might. They might. A woman came in with cancer. He said, "Hey, my this and he hey, they might. What he did? He marked what city she was in." Color kind of dress she was wearing. Preacher get up there and say, God, uh, I got a woman here, don't know who it is. She's in the Martin Blue, so she dressed back there in number two. Hey, Amen. What well, she thinks, you know, hey, there's a man of God. No, it's a man of the devil. Amen. It's what it is. Hello, it's phony. Hey, Amen. Uh, some of them, uh, let me tell you something. Uh, Joe Osteen, uh, hey, man, $49 million a year. Hey, man, and you've got hungry people out on the street. Hey, man, that's not godly. Hey, man, no matter how you look at it. Hey, man, well, I give to the poor. You got poor all around you, and you won't even buy them a dinner. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I need that jet to fly around so I can make more money. One in Texas got 12 jets. Current for a dollar. Yeah. It was 12 jets. Yeah. Now you tell me why you need 12 jets to preach the word of God. Amen. You don't need it. In the Pope, you might. 500 million. You might. You might. You might. I'd, 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 I'd love to be there listen to the reason when they stand there before God. Hey, man, when you said, what about that hundred man that you all just walked by? Hey, man, why didn't you give him something? Hey, why didn't you put him up for the night? Hey, man, hey, listen, well, it was too important to mess with that. God came down in the ditch where I was at. Amen. And pulled me out. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, man, listen this morning, church. Hey, man, just keep on praying and keep on believing. Amen. Amen. Because it does work. Amen. It might not be on our time. Amen. But God is working. Amen. There's no doubt I'll tell you. It ain't going to work. It ain't going to work out. Let me tell you something. Can you imagine what that old devil? Amen. And Daniel. Amen. They kept on old Daniel every day. Well, where's your God at? Amen. Daniel kept a prayer. Amen. Amen. You imagine how every day, Terry, how you know the old devil was there. Amen. I say, where's your God? Amen. Gee, God answered him on the 21st day. He said, Daniel, I heard you all along. The first time you bet, pray, I heard you, Daniel. Amen. Amen. This morning, hey, listen, don't give up on God because he won't give up on you. Amen. 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 Shut up. <laughs> you, might, you, might. you know, take the word with you. You, might. you know what? It's not how high we can jump here, it's how we walk on the hell of that door. Amen. Amen. You might, you might. I don't I don't I don't need a sign of where I'm 
on my Jared shirt yeah. uh, say I'm a Christian. <laughs> amen. If people can't tell, amen, well, how we talk, we walk, amen, uh, we're a Christian, then we're doing something wrong. Amen, amen brother. Yeah. I was in the doctor's office one day. He always said, what are you doing here? <laughs> I said, I'm just here to prove your doctor's wrong. <laughs> One of those helpers came in and said, uh, you driving that red Dodge? I said, yeah. I had somebody back there to it. I said, well, I'll get done. We'll be out there. You know. She came in three times. She said, now he's a really nice guy. They thought I was going to get up and start cussing, raising all kinds of candy. So they went out there. This little skid thing on the bumper. They said, let me get hey, hey, you can take it now with my, for my, much money. I said, don't worry about it, I can bump it out. They said, let me give you $50. I said, I want your money. You take it and use it. Don't worry about that. I can bump it out. Amen. He turned to walk away and he said, you're a Christian, ain't you? I said, I try real hard. Yeah. <laughs> you know, this is hard. You know what? They was expecting the devil to show up and start cussing and raising candy. And this little old man, and you could tell he didn't have much. Amen. I mean, listen. Amen. Amen. It's not about getting the last word in, it's about getting the word of God in. Amen. Yes, it is. In your family, friends, and, and this and that. Amen. No matter what you do. Thank God with you. Amen, brother. You know, the old body and the old flesh won't get that last word in. That makes us feel like we're heroes. Yeah. Jesus said if they hit you on one side, turn the cheek. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. If you got two coats, give them one. If you walk a mile with them, Terry, it said go two miles. Yeah. Amen. The flesh will say, I'm not fooling with them. That fool is crazy. I'm not fooling with them. Listen, what if it said that about me and you? Amen. That's we when he came down and hung on that cross, I'm not doing it. The people don't even love me. That's right. That's right. They likewise. We're supposed to be alive. Can see. Amen. 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 You know, my old friends invite me out to go have a beer with them because they know, they know about it. Yeah. <laughs> they don't invite me to go play pool because it's in the and they know about it. Amen. People ought to know where you stand with God and what you stand for. Amen. <laughs> Don't worry about getting the last word in. I believe he said, the opinions of mine, ain't it somewhere in there? Yeah. Amen. Listen. Amen. Amen. We ought to be Christ like out there in the world. Yes. Amen. That's looking for something and anything. Amen. A lot of them ain't heard the word of God. Amen. I, I, I told Stevie here, or I thought and sat there thinking when Stevie was preaching, like I said earlier, I, there were some people family wouldn't talk to each other, hadn't talked to each other for you. There were some couldn't even be invited. Because that's what Sandra wanted, my sister. I see it here, daughter was she gonna tell her, her last wish is she going she told her. Hey man, I don't know what was going on. But you know what? Without God. Hey man. Hey man. You want to get that last word in. It makes the flesh feel good for God. Amen. Oh, chest out. Oh, I told them all. Hey man. Hey man. Hey man. I'd rather do it like this. Hey man. That guy one time he worked for himself. Hey man. This is out of his pickup truck. I might have told this before. Hey man. Hey man. He went and done this job on this guy's house. And the guy come out complaining. Hey man. He said, I'm not paying you. Hey man. And then they found out later that's what this guy does. You know, he, he gives everybody a hard time about paying. He just put his stuff in the back of his tube. 
Take it up. And one up. Amen. Two, three, march one by. Amen. And he looked this guy up. Amen. Guy would call him and say, I ain't paid you. Back about two or three months, he was looking for him to pay him. Matter of fact, he wanted to pay him extra. Amen. He said that day, amen, his water lines broke. Amen. He went out and had a flat tar. Started to the store to come away. The transmission went out. Amen. He, he, gave, he got it when he found it. He gave him a lot of money. He said, take it. Give Jesus off my back. He said, I didn't see him, Jesus. Amen. But you must have a guilty conscience. Amen. Amen. Jesus will have the last word. Amen. Amen. He will. Get your song ready. I'm through. Amen. I have a Victor Clark today, I believe. Amen. I'm going to put Marks up. Preach your shit. Preach your shit. I'm just aggravating you right now. Well, let's now say again. Well, let's sing that song. We appreciate the gift. Thank <laughs> you.